Welcome to your free video lesson from Teach You Comp Incorporated. Be sure to check out your exclusive discount offer at the end of your free lesson. When you want to add a new task to your task list, click the New Task button that appears in the standard toolbar or double click on any empty row within your task list and that will display the task window. Now, click into the subject text box and type the subject of the task. If you have to complete the task by a certain date, click the drop down arrow to the right of the due date to select a date from the calendar drop down. If the task has a start date, you can choose the start date by clicking the drop down arrow to the right of the start date box and then selecting a date from the calendar drop down. You can click the drop down arrow to the right of the status text box to select the option which best describes the status of this task. You can then click the drop down arrow to the right of the priority text box to select a suitable priority for the task. For longer projects, you can actually enter the amount of work completed on this task by using the spinner arrows that are located to the right of the percent complete box. Note that also changes the status. You can also have Outlook issue a reminder for this task if desired. If you have specified a due date for this task, Outlook will already have created a reminder for you. But if not, check the reminder checkbox to set a reminder and then click the drop down arrow to the right of the reminder box in order to select a reminder date from the calendar. You can then set a reminder time by clicking the drop down arrow to the right of the time. Now any additional information required to complete this task should then be entered into the text area in the bottom half of the dialog. Also, as with appointments and meetings, you can click the Categorize button in the Options group on the Task tab in the ribbon to associate the task with one or more categories. Note in that same group, you can also click the Private button in order to mark this as a private task. Now once you're ready, click the Save and Close button in the Actions group on the Task tab in the ribbon of the Task window to save the task and add it to your task list. Thank you. We hope you enjoyed your free video lesson from Teach You Comp Incorporated. Like what you see? Pick up your copy of our complete tutorial today and be sure to visit us at www.teachucomp.com slash YouTube for your special bonus offer. Our complete tutorial featuring introductory through advanced material is available on CD-ROM or digital download. You will receive our high quality video lessons plus printable instruction manuals in one easy to use training package. With over two dozen titles to choose from, you'll be sure to find the training you need in Microsoft Office, QuickBooks, Photoshop, and much more. Visit us today!